Holy COVID. I want you to know how much destruction you have caused in my heart and in my families. A week ago today, you took one of the most important people in my life and in my families away from us. And for that, I hate you. I hate how much you stole the life from my grandpa throughout the 18 days he fought against you in the hospital. And I hate how I had no choice but to watch helplessly as my family and our own hearts all went down with him. I hate how it feels as if you were just biding your time for almost a year as he tried so hard to avoid any encounter with you. COVID, you are a coward. You prey on those who have lived more life than most of us and you show no mercy in how you take over. But do not be mistaken, my grandpa will always be stronger and more impactful than even the greatest pain you have caused. Because although you may have stopped his heart, you have not and will not ever take his spirit, nor his very DNA that lives in me and in so much of my family. I hate you, COVID, but while you have broken all of our hearts, you have also lit a fire within us. As my grandpa would always say to me, don't get it twisted. Because COVID, you are a work of evil, a serpent of some kind. And my God tells me that I have all the power and the authority in Jesus' name to step all over you. And that is what I plan to do for the rest of my life. You may have stopped my grandpa's heart, but together, mine and my family's continue to beat for him. Stronger than you could ever multiply to overcome in even your greatest of attempts. COVID, you have made me feel an anger I have never known. You have taken some from you have taken someone from me who helped shape me over the past 29 years. But what you forgot to also take are the lessons, the wisdom, and the strength that my grandpa gave to each of us. I know that my grandpa is still very much alive in us, and for this failed attempt of yours, I laugh at you. Because more than ever now, I am determined to focus on loving my family how he did. Focusing on what's important like he did. Cutting out the BS like he did. Never giving up like he didn't being brave like he always was and making him proud like I know he would be. COVID, you have changed all of our lives forever, but make no mistake, you have lost. You are the only loser here because to be such a microscopic and conniving virus, everything you are not is in plain sight to us. You are not love. You are not strength, you are not hope, you are not good, and you are not victorious. You are lacking all the attributes a true victor carries. The very same attributes my grandpa exemplified every single day of his life. And what we are, what my grandpa instilled in each of us is so much more than you could ever mutate to become. COVID, you are a thief, a cheat, a liar, and in the name of all that is good and in honor of my grandpa's life, I promise to live mine to the fullest and to remind you every day how much you took from us, yet how much you still have lost by becoming stronger with each tear shed and more grateful with each inhale of my lungs. And just as you did it, we will show no mercy as we carry on in the name of my grandpa, Neil Redford. Hey, COVID, I don't need a vaccine now to tell you how dead you are to me. And because of your pathetic attempt to slow us all, my grandpa's spirit is alive now more than ever. So don't get it twisted.